Well, happy pre-Friday, East Texas outside. I'll tell you what, what a gorgeous, crisp, cool sunrise. This is taking a look from uh, Tyler Pounds Regional Airport. You can see the beautiful sunrise underway here. Clear skies should be a gorgeous day, but the purple doesn't look as nice when you see it on the temperature change map. Whenever you see this here, it means pay attention because there's a big difference out there and we are about 25 to 30 degrees colder than where we were yesterday at this time. So you've got to dress for temperatures that are much colder than what we saw yesterday, believe it or not. Now outside across the Lone Star State, we're not the only ones dealing with the cold. Now down into the 40s along the Gulf Coast. We're in the 30s in Dallas, 20s in Lubbock, teens. The teens have returned to Texas in the Texas Panhandle. Now, as we're going a little closer to East Texas, you can see winter is here with all of us, except for Jasper. You're still in the mid-40s, but everyone else definitely cold. 30 in Marshall, 32 in Greenville, 36 in Athens and Tyler, 34 Longview, 36 in Nacogdoches and Crockett, and 33 right now in Anderson County. So as we walk you through your day, Temperatures will climb into the upper 40s across the north by lunchtime. We'll be in the lower 50s across the south. But the good news, chilly, but plenty of sunshine. And so this afternoon, we're only going to warm into the low, maybe mid 50s with that sunshine. But still, you're going to have to bundle up. It'll be a cool day for sure. Tonight, clear skies, light winds that allow us the heat to escape that builds up during the day. So I think we will flirt with the freezing mark in many spots. So that means a frosty start maybe even a light freeze in spots and highs only rebounding once again only into the low to mid 50s as it go throughout your Friday afternoon. Again, you saw it on our tower cam. There are plenty of clear skies across the region. As we expand the view, the real story on the surface map, the strong cold front taking spring away, old man winter building in from the north and west, those northwesterly winds ushering in that colder air mass, and that's what we're going to be experiencing. And it's not just for today. It's through the rest of this work week into the weekend as that trough or that cool air mass stays in place across East Texas. And then as we head towards next week, it tries to moderate just a little bit, but that just means a west-northwesterly flow. That's a dry flow. So overall, if you need some rainfall, you want some precipitation, uh, not going to happen over the next seven days. 52 degrees for your high today, 54 as we go throughout your Friday. Again, we'll flirt with freezing both Friday and Saturday mornings, maybe even Sunday morning, before we slowly try to moderate things heading into the beginning of next week. 